Hey, hey, everybody. I am the great and powerful Cheese Fry, and welcome. Let me get my cursor off. There we go. Welcome back to One Shot. Um, I think I already did that intro. Uh, anyway, um, there were some technical difficulties that I had to take care of, and, uh, and here we are. So, um, this box looks interesting. I wish I had something to pry it open with. Let's see. Self-charging solar battery model N87. One year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery in full daylight <laughs> with the lens facing up. Charges in seconds. No external power is needed. If battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens is on the front side have not been dislodged during transport. Once charge cycle will last 10 days. If you notice a decline in the charge cycle within the warranty period, please contact the manufacturer. Yep, I think we're... Uh, oh, it's just Asimov's rules of or laws of robotics. Aha, here we go. So we're in the Barrens. And then there's like this ocean thing. And then there's the Glen. And then the Refuge. And then the Tower. And we want to be... So we're as far away from the thing as we can possibly be. And we have to work our way in. Okay. I wish we could, you know, rip that off the wall and take it with us. I guess that's not something we can look at. All right. Anyway, these are just a bunch of robots. Uh, this, I believe, had something important, though. Um, the use of a robot as a replacement head engineer seems unorthodox. Especially the one responsible for last year's accident. I suppose they had to get her away from the city, but that doesn't make it easier to swallow for those of us who work here. I hope that man knows what he's doing. Management. Yep, that sounds about right. It's a company, so everything is through management. <laughs> What's this? A page with faded ink. Able to provide power to all robots and machinery in the area via large electromagnetic field maintenance efforts are quite high as expected. We have provided customized backup cells for few most important robots. Their electromagnetic fields are much weaker, and the signals are highly specific. In other words, these small cells can only charge one single... Bleh. The rest of it's unreadable. All right, so, so this place is just up shit creek without a paddle. It looks like uh, some sort of small machine. I wonder what it does. I can feel my hair standing up a little. Oh, so that's like that electromagnetic charger things. Small glowing shrimp in the jar. So that's your phosphor. There's a big machine. It doesn't seem to be doing anything though. It's a rectangular shaped hole in the middle. Looks like something used to fit there. Okay. If I know my stuff, then a battery should go there. So let's just explore. ProfitBot's not going to help us any. So, um... Huh... Ooh! What's here? What's that? What's that? What is this? Oh, music changed. And I just noticed it. A uh, robot sitting on a conveyor belt doesn't seem to have power. Robot doesn't. Seems to be okay, just doesn't have power. So, we should be... Big machine, looks like a press used to crush metal. Big machine, looks like it's used to crush metal. Big machine, it looks like it's used to press... To... Looks like a press to crush metal. Oh, they're all the same thing. I thought he was saying something different every time. Let's see, like... Oh, there it is. I... This machine's still running. Maybe I shouldn't stand so close to it. What if my scarf gets caught in there and then it'll pull me in? And, yep, yep. Yeah, we just need to get far away from there. Get, get, get away from there, Neko, please. He's like, I, I don't want to think about that. I, I just, I saw my life flash before my eyes just, just then. What the fuck? Oh no. All right. So, God, this, the music and the, uh, the environment, very pretty. See. Not to knock on uh, Undertale, because I do thoroughly love that game, but this is pixel art done right. Like, this uh, this is good stuff. In fact, I believe I'm going to play Momodora as well. So, if anyone knows that one, Momodora Reverie Under the Moonlight, which I think... I was told that that was actually the fourth game in the series. What's over here? Ooh, a note. 
Although this poisonous gas is highly localized to the, be the vent zones, Baron's workers are still recommended to wear gas masks. These masks are mandatory we around active vent sites, of course. As more and more of their workforce got replaced by robots, we found ourselves with the surplus of abandoned gas masks. It seems like a waste to get rid of them all, so we kept a few for emergencies. Okay, so I should be able to find one of those then. I should be able to find a gas mask. No problem. According to that information. Hello. A metal safe. It looks like it's locked with a six-digit code. I don't remember seeing six-digit codes. Do you cheese fry? Nope. That wasn't it. Nope. All right. Uh, there's a lot of just wreckage around here. Oh, another note. Just a ton of wreckage. A torn page with faded ink. With the mining operations going smoothly, materials are no longer our limiting factor. We will be able to build more resilient robots, both in body and mind. Specifically, the discovery of the metal alloy 291 will likely allow the development of highly efficient circuitry. Well, that's good, you know, when, you're, when your whole frickin' world depends on a light bulb as the sun. I'm kind of curious to... You know, I can't help but wonder, what made the last sun... Oh... There's something in the air here. It hurts to breathe. Let's let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Let's go back. Go 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 go. Okay. Um. Um. So, oh, I can't help but wonder what made. Okay. There's nothing over here. What made the last one? What made the last sun disappear? That's the question. Right. Because something happened, for sure. Uh, I don't know which way I'm going at this point. I should have been able to go up this way. There we go. Nope, there's nothing over there for me to go to see. So, like, what happened to the last sun? Did it break? Did it... Did the filament just break? <laughs> did it get twisted one half turn too far and got, a uh, got disconnected and it's just as simple as someone needs to go up there and twist it back on instead of having this other worlder and uh, this world's god do it for you I don't know I don't know I'm just trying to open dead or you know fill dead space what's over here Ooh, what is over here what is this strange black plants they look like clovers What's in here? Hello? Oh, the light bulb. So, are you the messiah? That's what I've been told. I expected someone taller. Okay. God damn it. It is not my fault. Okay. I am 5'5". Five five. That is tall the fuck enough, okay? <laughs> God damn it. Or at least someone that didn't look like a kitten. Alright, double fuck you, alright? That's what you are, right? Some sort of cat? Nuh-uh! I'm a person! You got the eyes of a cat. But cats walk on four legs. Well, either way, I like Neko. I like Nick. Uh, I'm t t uh, No, I'm not a cat. Cats walk on four legs, dummy. <laughs> a child like you being the messiah just doesn't feel right. But that robot back there says there's no mistake. I know. <sighs> this is going to sound cold, but... I honestly think you're better off just leaving and letting the world die naturally. The world has been falling apart for a long time. This manner of decay, it's highly unprobable that the sun can fix it. You've already seen how bad it can get, right? We haven't seen much of anything, actually. And we can't really just leave. Oh, so you just got here. Then you must be headed towards the tower. Mm-hmm. It's where I'm supposed to put the light bulb, 
the sun, isn't it? Yes, at the very top. We know that the tower contains a force nobody could comprehend, and the power is strongest at the summit. Maybe it will send you back home after you complete your mission. Oh! Don't take my word for it, though. Oh. Well, fuck. <laughs> Alright, then. Dear Silver, so this must be Silver. I heard the news about the mines. I'm sorry. I can't imagine what you're feeling. It's been two weeks. <clears throat> I have to resist the urge. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna let the, 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 the just a small clip of the song play so I can get it out of my system. It's been one week since you looked at me. Thank you. I know it must be hard, but it's better that you came back. It's only a matter of time before the robots are recalled. Oh, the robots were spelled differently. At least let me know you got my message, okay? All right. What is this? Please do not touch that. Oh, sorry, I got curious. What is this thing? Backup power cell. It keeps me functional. The main generator for the Barons ran out of power some time ago. It could not even last a week without the sun. Sorry to hear that. All we can do is make sure, make use of the light we have. Which is dwindling. Something is, ah, it's a screwdriver. You can take it if you want. It may help you. Oh, are you sure? Yes, I have many. Thank you. Yay. Yay, we got a screwdriver. Yay. Is that a chess table? Oh, that's interesting. I haven't played chess with anyone else for a very long time. Oh? Not even with the other robots? No. Nobody in the Barrens have that capacity in their programming. Nobody here is tamed, for that matter. Okay, wait, hold on, that's a new word. Tamed? What do you mean? What is- what is that? What- what is- what is tamed? What does that mean? What's that mean? That's gonna be like the theme, the- the- the, uh... The- the thing I- I'm gonna just keep saying throughout this. What's that mean? Ooh, what's this? Wait. Uh? What is this? I saw you heading towards this direction. The mines have been abandoned for a very long time. I cannot guarantee that it's safe. If you must enter it, it's my duty to accompany you at least once. Oh, thanks. Ooh, here we are. Cool. 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 There's a little gadget on the ground. It looks kind of like a camera. Uh, what's left of a camera, anyway? Probably even part of a robot, at one point. Oh. Oh. Or not. I don't know. Wow, Silver, you're like really, really apathetic about this whole thing. It's another one of those shrimp jars. So yeah, that's what... Okay, stay on the... See a faint light, yellow light in the... Don't stand so close to the edge. Oh, sorry. Looks like even the entrance of the tunnel collapsed off. But there's, there's... Oh, without a vehicle, we can't proceed. Can't we walk? I can. But for you, it's a safety violation. I won't allow it. What's ahead, anyway? It's a huge network of underground mines. The source of this world's... Blah, blah, blah. Metal and non-phosphor fuel. So if there's a yellow light, that means it's combusting. That's, um... That's no good. That means there's a fire. There's a fire down in there. This is what propelled the world into the industrial age. So now it's lost forever? It's been a while now. When the sun went out, the mines were the first to be abandoned amidst the initial panic. Even the robots have cleared out of the and been repurposed. That makes sense. Though there was one that always insisted on going back. Oh? I hope he's okay. I feel like Silver might be a female, but, um... I'm just gonna keep voicing 
it as a as a male because that's my vocal range. All right, ready to leave? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's good to know that um, Neko has a mind of, I guess, his own. So if I just keep walking and don't go into the mine, oh, that's all that's back here. Okay, never mind. All right, so I think there was another spot that I could go. Yeah, up here. What is it? Ooh. No power. Just like the rest. And there's those black clovers all over the place. I don't know what those are. Or what the, uh, the, uh, significance of them are. Oh, god damn it. I do like how they do it, though. The, the screen transitions. Okay, so... What's over here? I'm gonna be stuck here for a while, and I will. I, oh god. Okay, that's the that's the vents. Come come on back, 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 back. Um. Oh man, I refuse to look through a walkthrough though. I will not. I will not do that here. Um. See, there's another note over there. It's looking like I might need to find the. Uh, fuck. I might need to find the. Uh, The sun will not return, and the abyss is calling my name. I'm sorry, everyone, for choosing to leave before the darkness suffocates us all. Well, shit. That means that someone left that suicide note and then jumped. Which, I mean, that kind of raises up a question, like, if... If you knew... that that you were gonna die without without a doubt if you knew um, would you would you go ahead and take it into your own hands or would you um, I don't remember seeing any six digit codes no no I don't either nothing all right wasn't it so uh, I think we're we're reaching a point where I kind of have to wrap it up, even though this one was only 15 minutes long. Um, I thank you guys for watching. Stick around. I'm going to try and be a little more consistent. <laughs> and uh, as always, stay cheesy.